Howdy, howdy, all you beer lovers, and uh, welcome to another edition of McCall's Flask. And I'm going to get a little away from the camera. I've got a uh, great view. And I've been thinking about this one uh, all winter long, doing a uh, little traveling around to the uh, various outside decks or beer gardens of Traverse City. And I'm going to make my way. Uh, I'm not actually going to do a beer review today. But I'm going to make my way to uh, the various breweries, do a little uh, little attachment down there in each one. This video is going to be a little longer uh, than most because it's uh, featuring uh, seven different breweries here in the uh, Traverse City area. And the reason why I wanted to do this is when you're coming to Traverse City, I want you to make sure that uh, you stop by uh, the breweries, sit on the outside. That's, that's where you'll find me. Um, a lot of my videos, which uh, if you're a sus already a subscriber, you see I uh, gravitate to the outdoors, uh, evaluate a beer. Uh, but I, I think it was time to uh, not only evaluate a beer, but to stop by, see how the, uh, the, the decks look. And I'm going to take you on a little tour uh, around Traverse City. So. Uh, if you're interested in the different places, definitely uh, watch this video all the way to the end. I'll add some uh, little spots into where we're at and kind of give you, a, you know, if they're dog friendly uh, kind of thing. But, you know, especially with with our animals, we, we love them dearly. But uh, some places don't allow dogs, but uh, that's all right. So it doesn't hurt to get on their website and uh, see if they're dog friendly. So let's uh, get out there. Probably going to drink a beer as I go, so uh, let's enjoy Traverse City's outside and what all these breweries have to offer. All right, let's go, everybody. All righty, uh, our first uh, stop here on our deck tour is uh, my personal favorite, Traverse City's oldest Brew Pub, North Peak Brewing Company. It's been here since uh, 1997, and uh, we got one of Brian's beers to enjoy. And it's a beautiful uh, little deck. It's the, the first one that actually uh, um, really started the trend where people were coming down here to see what it was like to sit outside um, in northern Michigan. And it's a, a nice little deck. Uh, who knows, there might be some music. Things have changed since COVID, but uh, uh, come on down and start your uh, your tour of Traverse City's brew pub decks to the first one. Here's to North Peak. All right, everyone, on our uh, next stop is actually Traverse City's newest uh, brew pub. It's uh, Local Boys over here on the uh, western side of Traverse City. It's on Front Street. They just uh, recently opened and their deck, which we're uh, sitting out, is brand new. It's They, they just put the chairs out here a couple days ago um, and people are uh, sitting out here enjoying uh, their, uh, their nice facility. It uh, is not dog friendly, but that's all right. Alrighty, our next stop on our uh, our patio deck tour or beer garden tour is uh, Middle Coast Brewing Company. And, you, and you, if you've watched a lot of my videos, you do feature that I really like coming down here. I love to uh, sit out by their fire in the middle of winter. Uh, very, very nice little deck it's on uh, State Street in Traverse City, Michigan, right downtown. And I'll span the camera. You can see the uh, the tables and all that. And then they also have on this side over here. Uh, they have a little camper that's converted so people can uh, sit back there and enjoy. Um, it is a dog friendly uh, um, patio out here. So uh, another spot for you to choose from is uh, Middle Coast Brewing Company. So hope you're enjoying all your time outside. All right, everyone, we're, uh, we made a stop now over at Silver Swift Brewing Company on 8th Street in Traverse City, Michigan. And uh, as you can see, they've got a really good outside deck. What makes it kind of nice is in the, uh, the those times when we had rainy weather, they got a really beautiful place for uh, sitting outside uh, so you don't get wet. And uh, it's very lively out here. We've got a lot of people out here in this neck of the woods. See if we can get a few people in, in here. 
uh, but it's a, a great deck so if you're uh, and you can tell by the, the bark that it's uh, dog friendly so you can bring your your uh, your uh, friend out here they do have a watering uh, spigot so you can actually uh, your dog can get some water but it's a very beautiful little nice little spot they added this last year and it is uh, phenomenal of course we do a lot of videos here at uh, Silver Swiss Brewing Company. It is a neighborhood brew pub. Um, Andy loves to do lagers, so if you're into a good lagered beer, which this is a Vienna lager, which I'm enjoying while uh, after this video is over with, uh, he's really top notch, knows his lagers real well. So it's a great place. Bring your puppy, bring your friends. Come on down 8th Street here at Silver Spruce Brewing Company. 8th Street, Traverse City. Alrighty, our uh, next stop here in our uh, outside seating uh, reviews. Uh, we're at Workshop Brewing Company. It's uh, in the Garland District of Traverse City, Michigan. And it was actually the original location of Right Brain. Uh, and Right Brain was in this location for many years. Uh, but they wanted to get into a bottle and canning so they had an opportunity to move and uh, obviously we'll be out on their deck here in another episode and uh, this so this came in afterwards because it actually kind of fit all the drainage was there um, the the tank area is pretty much the same um, they just had to get up and running and as you know the workshop also has their uh, little satellite uh, uh, brew pub down in Kingsley, Michigan, and we've done quite a few reviews there. So their outside seating is really, really nice. They've got a nice little place to eat over there, and uh, another one of those that's uh, dog friendly. Um, last year, if you uh, go back to uh, the workshop beer review, they I interviewed some people having uh, a nice meal during the National Cherry Festival. We had helicopters flying by. Uh, a great place to sit back and relax. Uh, very, very comfortable. Cornhole is out there. You can see the, uh, I like the, the mosaic that they have on their wall. It's uh, really, really pretty. And a lot of my videos, I like this side of their uh, seating area, their beer garden, uh, because of that. So definitely put workshop on your spot to go. Come out here and enjoy this. They do have live music on Friday and Saturdays. So uh, let's go to the workshop. Alrighty, uh, we've made our way to uh, Right Brain Brewery and we're out here, here in their beer garden and another one of those that's uh, very dog friendly. I've got their uh, their coaster and we've done a lot of reviews here for Right Brain and um, as we've, we've mentioned, this is their second location. They, they moved down here on 17th Street and they just celebrated their 15th uh, anniversary and uh, had an opportunity to chat with Russ real quick that day. Um, very, very nice place. Um, real close to the Tart Trail, so they get a lot of bikers. And it is uh, dog friendly. Uh, very nice and pleasant. Uh, of course, you know, Right Brain's got a lot of pinball machines in there. I'll probably go and play at least one game uh, of pinball before I leave here today. And you see just a, a nice and pleasant. They do live music. They added uh, back in their actual uh, brewing facility in the back. They have large enough to uh, accommodate uh, three to 500 people. And they get different bands and they uh, play along there. So, but it is summertime. This is all about being outside in the beer gardens. And uh, so you definitely make a Right Brain Brewery here on 17th Street in Traverse City, Michigan, one of your stops. Uh, bring your dog, bring your bike, come on down. Are you? All right, we're at the filling station down here in Traverse City, Michigan. And uh, filling station's been around for a long time. They uh, got a great out. And you can see all the way down there that it's really, really nice, nice and big. I'm standing actually kind of in the middle of it. And you can tell that a lot of people are enjoying this uh, outside seating that they have. Alrighty, our next stop, uh, we're at uh, Rare Bird Brewing Company over here on Lake Street in Traverse City. And uh, they've got a nice little small addition to their, their beer garden, as we can see if we can bring it around. we got a nice little bar out here. We've got some people going on. It is dog friendly, very nice outside um, and 
today I'm, I've got a, a blood, or, blood orange wit while I'm uh, making this video. But uh, Rare Bird has been a great addition to uh, the uh, the family of breweries. They, they, they're phenomenal. Nate, is, uh, one of the cores, more of the, uh, the beverage manager, uh, is doing a fantastic job and we're glad to have him part of that. So again, another one of those great little spots. Uh, people coming in and all out. It's lively right here. Uh, so stop by uh, Rare Bird. Get yourself a beer. Enjoy another outside seating area here in Traverse City, Michigan. All right, on to the next stop. Hello, everyone. We made another stop out here, uh, and we're outside in the uh, the patio area of Earth and Ales over in the Grand Traverse Commons. Uh, another outside wonderful deck. A lot of families roaming around. And let, let's take us over and let's see if we can see the... Uh, all right, so there's part of the old water tower. Let's get underneath. So there, there's the water tower underneath, and uh, makes it really, really nice. So you can you can see what we've got going on. Very nice outside, trees in the background, and uh, Earth and Ale's deck is very, very, very nice. So y'all, in your adventure, stop by Earth and Ale's here over in the Grand Travis Common and enjoy this outside deck. All righty, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed uh, my little uh, trip around Traverse City, Michigan, and uh, showing you the outside areas, the, uh, the beer gardens, the decks, whatever you want to call it. And I'm now currently in my home garden. And if you made it this far, um, you made it through all the breweries of the Traverse City. Now, there's more in northern Michigan that uh, if you're subscriber you already know you you know that I've made it to these places um, that outside have outside seating um, and sure I could have went to them all uh, but uh, this video would be so long that you probably um, aren't gonna watch it anymore um, one of the, uh, the the better decks or better outside beer gardens up in uh, Sutton's Bay Michigan is Hoplot it is phenomenal it's huge family friendly um, winter time they put igloos out for people to stay in summertime they uh, put picnic tables they've got their little bonfires you can get homemade s'mores uh, very very nice they've got food out there so that's my favorite big area lots of people terra firma just south of traverse city and uh, nice little deck out back nice little uh, tented area uh, very 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 nice very pleasant um, and it is kind of nice that it's off the beaten path. It's not next to any big mon um, big building or anything of that sort. Um, so it's it's nice and quiet. Uh, of course, the, John Niedermeyer, the uh, brewer slash owner, phenomenal guy, um, and makes great beer. And we've featured many of their beers in the videos. Over in the Acme area, the, the new one over there is uh, Stonehound. Uh, it's been around for a couple years and made it through COVID and they've got a little outside uh, seating in front of their establishment and it's got a great view of East Grand Traverse Bay uh, and that's just the the breweries let alone if you want over to Five Shores over in Pula um, another great big outside area they have music and when you're talking about that area you know, lake and brewing company um, it is all about their outside he's got music and you get on their website and there's somebody playing there um, all the time uh, great little pizza place uh, next door if you want to have some food ice cream place next door if you want to bring the food in uh, phenomenal it's uh, music and uh, Matt Theron is, is, is just great beers out there. Um, so even uh, when you make it over to Storm Cloud, they've got a nice little uh, outside area over in Frankfurt, Michigan. So if you're coming up, I hope I gave you a little view. Um, I hope to run into you uh, outside in the deck. Uh, when I'm home in my cigar, and, you know, uh, you know, with something that, that I didn't talk about because I didn't review beers on this little uh, transition, um, I actually uh, didn't go there to review a beer. So I drank things that I like, let's say what I would have liked, um, and made it very interesting to to go in and sit back and 
um, not really reviewing any of their beers, but reviewing their decks. So I'm glad you enjoyed it. Since I'm out here on my deck, I decided to pull one of these out of my uh, refrigerator. Sammy Adams Oktoberfest. Let's pop this top. Alrighty, and the glass of choice today, one of my favorite bars, the bar I grew up in, the UNI Lounge, downtown Traverse City. Fantastic uh, chicken euros, uh, lamb euros, all that. So I appreciate you taking the time. If you've made it this far in the video and you haven't subscribed, uh, you know, I'm really surprised because if you've made it this far, you should be a subscriber. Here's to you if you're going to have a beer. Have a good one. See you in the next review.